All right, y'all, so we want to get started with this New Year's haul. So I went to Sam's and where I go, y'all? We got cookies. Yeah, we got cookies. Sam's, GSS, and Audi. And so this is going to be our end of the year haul. Our New Year's haul, our celebration, our Kwanzaa, um, as well for our Kwanzaa party and stuff. I see, I'm going to show them the cookies, boo. All right, so here I'm making hoagies. So we got um, some French bread, French hoagie rolls from Sam's Club. And y'all, they were they only had this one left, right? So I grabbed it. And then I happened to look and I asked the lady, like, you know, do you have any more? And these just came out, y'all, nice and fresh. Look at the difference. <laughs> but either way, they getting toasted. So it'll all be delicious. Then um, we are going to have, like, just some nachos or tacos. I already decided. So I got some of this uh, to go with the nachos. I, that's from Sam's. And then at Costco, um, I wanted us to try the jalapeno lime um, tortilla chips. So this will be good for the day. We needed some mild cheddar cheese for the buffalo chicken dip. And in case anybody want to use that, like in their salads or tacos or whatever. And not this, because like me, I'm not a big fan of this. So we got that. Mom. Two of the French onion dips. Yeah, baby girl. Four chips and dip. Hold on, you'll get cookies in a minute. Finish eating your pizza. Oops. Sorry, I'm trying to get that out of your face. Alright. Then, um, so, this is... My daughter keeps asking me to get these, and every time I went, they didn't have them, so I've seen them, and I was like, you know what, let me go and get these. The sun-dried tomato turkey wraps. Um, these are really good, so this is just for whenever, um, you know, you just want to snack on some. All of us, really. But I got some cookies. Now, we were supposed to bake cookies, y'all, but I am exhausted. And yep. And I so bit the bullet, and I spent $20 on this. I really didn't want to, but I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm beat, y'all. I got to cut corners <laughs> a little bit here. Because I still got some cooking and stuff to do. Um, and then here, we got uh, just some iceberg and remain just for the tacos or nachos or just salad in general. Sorry, Red. Try not to. No, I'm trying not to get everything on our Kwanzaa stuff. I did fold up, you know, our mat and stuff, but make do, make do. All right, then we got some chocolate almond milk from Aldi. Um, I, usually, I usually get two, but I only see one, so I just got the one. From Sam's, I got some guacamole. Uh, again, for the nachos, for those who may want it. Now, again, another part of me cutting corners because um, I'm exhausted and I didn't start early enough. So I just got this pulled chicken for the buffalo chicken dip. Uh, it'll be good because I don't like canned chicken for buffalo chicken dip. And I usually make mine fresh and shred it myself. But I had this before and it's the closest thing to it as if I made it. So I'm just going to use that today um, since I'm behind on time. Then we needed some more ranch, so this is our favorite. Let me bring y'all down my bed, y'all. It's our favorite ranch here, the little house or lighthouse home style ranch. So I got two of those. I accidentally bust this open. <laughs> well, when I was trying to uh, get everything in there, but I got us the little sparkling drinks. There's two grape and two white grape. Um, so we drank the other ones we had throughout our Kwanzaa week, and then we're gonna have these tonight again when we go through um, and do our libations with our ancestors and everything. And just to celebrate today, I'm um, going into the new year. So, got those. There was only a little bit of those left. So, I was like, oh, I'm glad I at least had one, you know, for me to get. We got a lot of company, children over to celebrate with us. Alright, so I'm going to have to get this put away for now so I can eat. And then I'll start the cooking process. But I got us some meatballs from um, GFS for holiday meatballs. Uh, the one with the chili sauce and grape jelly. And I might make a, a marinara one too. We'll see. But um, at Costco, I got some wing dings. Um, this was just $13. I just got that because I'm going to marinate that and make it for actual New Year's Day. I was going to do it today, but I'm just tired. So I'm going to make it tomorrow for New Year's Day. Then I got some, uh, I say I'm some bonus, some chicken tenders, y'all. I got two of them because it's always so rare to see these now. <laughs> so I got two of them. I'll break it down, freeze it, and I'm going to uh, make some as well. And then I needed some ground turkey because I'm going to make um, for the 
the tacos and nachos and stuff. So I got two of the ground turkeys from Aldi. GFS, this is just for future. Um, I got some of the turkey Italian sausage. This brand here is like one of the only brands I know that tastes good and don't use pork as a casing. So I can actually eat the whole thing with um, peppers and onions and stuff like hot Italian sausage. So I got that for a future dinner or something. And then I needed another cream cheese because I'm down to I think like two like individual packs. So I'm going to use those for the... Um, the buffalo chicken dip so clearly i needed to get some more just to keep on hand yep and i got some of the mini chicken egg rolls from costco because you know my five year old love this bunny love these daggone things and they're still only ten dollars thankfully so i got another one of those um two orange juices from aldi because i just needed that so for chips and dip we got two things of the cheddar and sour cream ruffle chips from sam's Costco, I got these um, organic tortilla chips. Now, not that that mattered. It was just a matter of I seen the first when I first came in. And so I grabbed it for a taco night. And then, although I think there's some cheaper than these, y'all. And I, I went to Aldi after. So I got suckered and paying $5 for these. But, I mean, that's not too bad for this big thing. <laughs> but um, I got some Italian-style uh, cheese. Now, when I had got this... This is when I had in mind that I was going to do, like, be making the pieces and whatnot, and then, um, or the meatballs, but that got scratched. So we'll just have this to have it, because I ended up buying Domino's <laughs> pizza, because, again, I'm just trying for time, and I know they were hungry, and I still got to cook all the other stuff. I got two cucumbers, just so we I can slice it up. We can have that um, tonight as well. Um, get the banana ranch, however they theme fit. Two of the Doritos for the buffalo chicken dip. Y'all, that's literally the only thing we use this for. <laughs> buffalo chicken dip and walking tacos. Outside of that, we don't see no use for them. Alright, let me see here. Get out the way. At GFS, I got two bags of these already cut up um, collard greens. <laughs> Again, anything that's going to save me with time. Um, so I got that. These were only five dollars, so not bad for them to have already done the work for me, right? Outside of cooking it. And I think I gotta wash them again, but nonetheless, at least they already chopped up. And I got oh, I told y'all these two oranges, y'all. See, I'm out of it. Got some oranges here from Sam's Club. Yeah, got them from Sam's Club. Two almond milks because we have a lot of extra miles to feed this weekend. And I think we're already down like a good bit of our milk. And they only been here for like a day. <laughs> so anyway, I got two more of our almond milks. And see, they then tore up their little... One was just the cheese with the little white cheddar. And the other one, the white cheddar, child, the white garlic sauce. And the other one got mushrooms, red peppers. They tore that up as well. This is their favorite. That's all the stuff for that one. That's like literally their favorite um, combination. Mushrooms, red peppers, and tomatoes. Oh, yes. Yeah. All right, y'all. Let me make sure. I'm pretty certain. That's it. said, um, outside of, I got some plastic forks and some plastic cups. Um, already had plates here. And that is it, I do believe. So, yeah. It's a little me, my haul. I hope you guys enjoy your New Year's. This is our end of the year haul. For our New Year's celebration, more importantly, our Kwanzaa celebration, um, when we have people over and stuff. And today is Kumba. It is Creativity Day, y'all. So I hope you guys get creative and, and be active. Uh, to all my fellow brothers and sisters, happy Kwanzaa. To everyone else and all, happy New Year's. Hope you guys enjoy. Much peace and love. Oh, my son's giving y'all peace. That's right. Peace and unity. That's how we do it, huh? All right.